get it. That's Cher playing a tough Italian Brooklyn woman falling in love with Nicolas Cage, the brother of the man she's just become engaged to in Moonstruck. Our first movie is Moonstruck, and this is an entirely original, wacky, off-balance comedy that really surprised and delighted me. It's terrific. It stars Cher in the story of an Italian-American widow in her 30s who's engaged to marry a boring bachelor, and then she falls head over heels in love with a spaced-out brother. But the movie is not just about Cher's romances. It's about a whole gallery of great comic characters, and it involves the whole family, from grandfather and his four dogs, who live upstairs, all the way on down to several innocent bystanders who just happen to walk onto the scene. Here's a moment from early in the movie where Danny Aiello first proposes to Cher. So, where's the ring? The ring. A ring, that's right. I would have sprung for the ring if it was me, Kabish. You could use your pinky ring. I like this ring. You propose marriage to a woman, you should offer her a ring of engagement. But then Aiello flies off to Sicily to be with his dying mother in a moonstruck share is swept off her feet by her fiancé's ne'er-do-well younger brother. Where are you taking me? To the bed. Oh, oh God. Okay, I don't care. I don't care. Take me. Take me to the bed. I don't care about anything. I don't believe this is happening. That's Nicholas Cage, who will always hate his older brother because he made him look the wrong way and get his hand chopped off in a bread slicing machine. <laughs> Cage is great in this movie, and so is Olympia Dukakis, who plays Cher's mother. Here's a scene shortly after well, she's discovered that her husband is cheating on her. Coswell. What? I just want you to know, no matter what you do, you're going to die, just like everybody else. Thank you, Rose. You're welcome. That's Vincent Gardenia there as Cher's father. Eventually, the moment of truth comes, and the whole family is gathered around the breakfast table when Aiello tells Cher he cannot marry her. Well, she doesn't want to marry him. She's in love with Cage, but a promise is a promise. You are a big liar, okay, because I have a ring right here. Oh, I must ask for that back. Uh, I, uh, you know, all right, the engagement is off. Oh, in time, you will see that this is the best thing. In time, you'll drop dead, and I'll come to your funeral in a red dress. <laughs> and that's a great line in a movie that has a lot of great you lines. Bet. Those scenes can only give a hint of the richness of this movie, Moonstruck, which is one of the funniest American comedies of recent years. A lot of the credit has got to go to the director, Norman Jewison, and the writer, John Patrick Shanley, who have created not just one or two unforgettable characters, but they've worked on this project. They put in a whole movie full of interesting characters, including a middle-aged college professor who has a quiet little flirtation with Cher's mother. Then there's Cher's old grandfather who lives <laughs> upstairs with the four dogs. Old man, you feed any more of my food to those dogs and I'm going to kick you until you're dead. Those so, dogs those... eat so well in this movie, it's hilarious. <laughs> so does everybody in this movie. They're either eating, fighting, or making love. Cher is absolutely brilliant in the film. It's the best work she has ever done. And Nicolas Cage brings a controlled insanity to the younger brother that is just right, not over the top, just right. But the real discoveries in the movie are Olympia Dukakis and Vincent Gardenia as Cher's parents. <laughs> they are great. Moonstruck is a wonderful time at the movies, one of the year's best films. I don't know when I've laughed over your review while you've been giving it. and that Reminding you, right? Just reminding me of this film. It is hilarious. Now, I got a question for you. Norman Jewison isn't Italian. No. John Patrick Shanley doesn't... Probably, probably isn't <laughs> I would guess in no. the Irish I don't category. think Cher is Italian either. This uh, is one of the most, I, I don't know that, I can't, I'm not Italian, but it plays so authentic, at least in terms of what... It's not even that it's a... It's, it is, it is it's so Italian. It's Italian in certain details about the, 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 the tablecloths in the restaurant are red and, and white checks. This is about everybody who's ever had a family. Oh, everybody who's ever I, had a grandfather. Everybody okay. who's ever fallen in love with the wrong I guy know. at the wrong time. It's, it's, it's Italian, but it's universal. I understand that, but what I'm saying is that you can do Italian badly, yeah. and these people, as you said, mm -hmm. have fashioned mm -hmm. such an, a beautiful, authentic script. Mm -hmm. We have wonderful films made in Little Italy, yeah. uh, that have, that have, and we also have bad ones. Uh -huh. They've done a spectacular job, and I think it must go, I'll say the guy's name again, John Patrick Shanley, the writer. This is great. I mean, when everyone got this mm -hmm. script, they must have howled, just like... Uh, well, this movie is a treasure. This is one of those movies that, 
whether you remember the characters. You yes, I want to see it again now. I'll mention that college professor again because his little moment there yeah. where he has dinner with the, with the mother yeah. after having spent his entire life chasing after 20-year-old students. The now. writing is so powerful and uh -huh. punchy. Why do men have affairs? Because they're afraid they're going to die. I mean, and that so kind of husband life. walks in and she says, I want to tell you something. You're going to die. <laughs> right. <laughs> That's the pace of this movie. It's spectacularly written. Beautiful job. I hope that guy gets an Oscar nomination, if not an Oscar. John Patrick Shanley. And a few other people in the movie, you too. You bet. I'm sure they will. Two big enthusiastic thumbs up for Moonstruck, the hilarious romantic comedy directed by Norman Jewison. What we really like the most is Moonstruck. Boy, that comes out of the yeah. blue this year, and I just love it. I'm sure it's going to win a lot of Oscar nominations. I hope they don't overlook Olympia Dukakis. As, as the mother. As the mother. That's